Hey guys, so here is the finished table and um, wound up costing, I think, around 20 bucks just because the price of lumber is so insane right now. This literally would have cost, let's see, a one, two, maybe two two by fours and a um, thing. It would have cost around seven bucks before, maybe less. But now it's around 20 because of the lumber inflation prices. But, um, and just use the pocket hole screws. I'll link the video to the build on this if you guys want to uh, see um, how I built it. But um, super easy to do, and we think it turned out really nice. We were looking for a table that was a little taller because our couches, you know, so it can sit kind of behind there. You can put a basket underneath, and it's still, um, you know, pretty steady and stuff like that. So I think it turned out better than I dared hoped. I was like, well, I don't know. But the other tables on like Amazon stuff, they were looking like $100, 200 bucks and stuff. So I uh, just threw this one together. It took about a half hour or so um, to build just because I was kind of just going, playing it by ear. I didn't really have, I just, everything was in my mind. So, um, and put the stain on there. It took a little while, but all in all, probably about an hour's work. Um, I actually sanded it too, so maybe an hour and a half. <laughs> but anyways I think it turned out really good we're super happy with the way it looks the grain uh, with the stain we used a polyurethane or a stain with the uh, coating polyurethane in it so it's like a two-in-one type thing and the grain really stands out nicely you can see all the different um, things on there and it just looks really pretty I think um, so like the two by four here, I think that turned out really good. Just look at the uh, the wood there. It just it just looks really neat, and I'm, I'm super happy with the with the way it turned out. I even made a little mistake over here. Uh, the pocket holes, I they were supposed to be inverted on the other side, so the two by four would kind of cover it up. But just used a little bit of filler, and it stained over, and it's uh, just looks almost like nothing happened there. But uh, yeah. Um, we think it turned out great, so um, I thought I would share that with you. I promised to link this one in the description of the build, and so I'll link the build in the description of this video too, so you guys can check it out if you want to. All right, my friends, thanks for watching, and we'll see you all next time.